I get it. Well, actually, I don't get it. <laughs> Cause I'm beautiful. But uh, let me put you out of your misery. Oh, he got. Oh, he spit his head off. Hey guys, welcome to Live in Color. What's the last one? Yo, we see CJ dropped the new one two days late, but we're gonna get straight to it, man. Let's get it. Jay. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. It is finally time for another installment of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. The series that we observe some of the most outrageous, most outlandish moments to ever be seen by the human eye that just make you look at the screen like, well, goddamn, what did they do to make them is that mad? So, without further ado, roll them. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. First up to the plate is Sukuna being a dog. So Itadori and Fushiguro are fighting this ugly ass boy. What the f oh. is that? Jesus I'm Christ, bro, that teeth. is just ugly. So Itadori tells <laughs> Fushiguro, all right, listen, bro. I'm just gonna have to let that doll come out. So Sukuna comes down and he's like, hey, what's good with you, cuh? So the curse bags up and he's I like, oh, it. hell no. Nah. Who is this thug ass? Nigga? So then he starts talking to him like, boy, I tell you, boy, you ugly as sh the f you supposed to be a fish, a barnacle nigga. So he jumps back and starts charging up. Is that a Hadouken? So Brad shoots it, but he just stops it with one hand. Then he looks at him and says, you ugly lip motherfucker. Boy, I oughta to beat your ass. So Brad just face planted him into the ground. Then he starts looking at him like, damn, cuz the fade just started and your ass already on the ground. Nigga, you best get your sorry ass up. Yo, dog stepped on him. So then he tries to grab him, but he rips his arm off. Who said, damn boy, that gorilla grip done backfired on your ass. And yo, he is <laughs> laughing while he is doing this. Yo, this man is a demon. So later on, while he is continuing to laugh. this he game, got the flight the curse comes down and starts laughing at him. So then he starts looking at him like, why you got that big ass grin on your face? You think shit is sweet or something? Goof ass boy, I'll show you what's sweet. So then he hits him with the domain expansion. Damn. That was easy. Oh, boy, turn this man into a fish fillet cooked well done. <laughs> so then he says, all right, little nigga, you can come back out now. Hello, can you hear me, nigga? But then he gets no response, so he's like, so about a minute later, he pops up right behind Fushi Girl. So he's like, what's good, cuz? Just to let you know, I'm about to beat your ass. But before I beat your ass, I'm gonna eat this crusty ass finger. Ew. Nigga, savage. <laughs> the flavors are melting on my tongue. Wish I had a little bit of salt on the door. I ain't gonna lie to you, my boy. Now, time to beat your ass. So Fushi Weep. Girl starts swinging, Weep. but look at this oh. man. He is weaving yeah. all of his punches. With his hands in his pockets. Oh, no, nah, bro. In the uh, pocket? Don't when the nigga don't even want to take his no, hands. No, buddy, he's crazy. He's he had his hands so in his pocket. Like, the whole Damn, time. boy, you can't hear uh, shit. Come on now, put your back into him. Oh, touching him. Boy gave him the backhand of the century. So Fushi Girl trying everything. He trying to jump him with the snake, the owl. He just <laughs> eating it. Oh my he god. Up, so then he comes back down, grabs him, and he says, Come on now, there's a whole world out there we gotta see, nigga. Yo, bro, check his whole body. He said, A whole new world. Then bro starts playing ping pong with him. Bro said, come on now, get your sorry ass up. Oh, so as this man is flying through the buildings, the owl comes in and picks him up. He right behind him and he like, boy, that ugly ass knocked owl set your ass down. Hey. The owl yeah. got it too. <laughs> Good hey, God, he's that a beat savage. didn't even make any sense. <laughs> He just beat this man for just for absolutely no reason at all. That's <laughs> My crazy. God, yo, this man is disgusting. Mm. Yeah, when the rest of this manga gets animated, Homeboy is most definitely getting a full video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, next up on the list is Gojo's PowerPoint presentation. So while bro is on the way to go meet the principal, he tells the driver, yo, stop the car. So as the dude leaves, he says, all right, you could come out now. 
So then this ugly ass boy come from the yeah. top rope. Then dog said, What's what good? Is yeah, say? Bro, get ready to become Ooh. a pack. So he start throwing out everything. Bro threw some fat ass mosquitoes at him. He came <laughs> from the side and made him Ghost Rider. And then he decided to hit him with a gut check. So then after all that, bro is squeaky clean. He has taken he no even damage touch him. at all. So Volcano <laughs> Head, like, huh? Look what type of hacks you got? So then Gojo's like, you realize. You cannot hit me, right? So then he says, come here. Don't be shy. Come a little closer. But he looks so sad. Oh, so he tries to touch his hand, but he can't. Dog's so like, huh? What the f*** is this? What is he? So then Gojo's like, you feel that? This is called my infinity, a.k.a. my plot armor. So do you want to you touch are, buddy? him. You're fodder. Oh, he's fucked now. Good God, bro. Good. Check the life out of this man. Then dog said, hold on. I ain't even done yet. Bitch, oh, and he says, oh, you really Senator thought you was going to sneak me and get away with it? <laughs> Got of my face. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh he's God. done. Dog sent the flying and look at him. He yeah, dragging yeah. it the down. Yeah, was like, get your bum ass out of my sight. Look at him. He dragging his dirty ass through the ground. <laughs> and he just hit him with a gallic gun. Oh, he, he sent him out. Like, oh, if you don't That's sit crazy. your goofy ass down. Oh my Dang, god, bro that was is crazy. gone. So then Gojo's like, oh, this is a Stop perfect them. time. So this man leaves, goes and sees Itadori, and he's like, yo, do you want to watch me beat this nigga's ass? Huh? What? So he brings <laughs> he this man to the fight. So then he says, just to whoop right, his ass? Class is in session. Nah, Today we will be he's on demon time. If you got to bring someone else to watch that person get slumped, you a demon. Just saying. Crazy learning how to beat a nigga's ass 101. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, but he will be used as a demonstration today. I beg your pardon? <laughs> Dog's like, you mother Hey, stop old. playing with my name, nigga. But then Gojo's like, <laughs> your name? But you are weak. You're trash. I bet you half of the people that watch this show don't even know your name. Dang, oh, he came for his soul. I don't even remember his name. <laughs> oh, hold shit. on, hold on. Let's look him up real quick. Volcano head in JJK. Jugo? Jogo? Yeah, let's just go with Jugo. Jogo? All I know is he looked like Squidward when he had the volcano on his head. <laughs> but like anyway, bro got pissed. He was like, stop playing with my name. So then he uses his domain expansion and he done turned this bitch into Bowser's castle. So then Gojo's yeah. like, I right, like you pay close attention. So bro takes off the blindfold and hits him with the Finally. domain expansion. Beautiful nigga void. <laughs> Oh shit, he came back with his. So bro's like, Ugh, what is this? Pause, but who is this beautiful ass nigga? <laughs> who is this beautiful ass nigga? Well, then Gojo comes behind him and he's like, you know, man. Uh, he's he touching him. Like, Trust me, I get it. Well, actually, I don't get it. <laughs> Cause I'm beautiful. But uh, let me put you out of your misery. Oh, he got Oh, he spit his head off? He just ripped his head off with no! one hand. And to add to the disrespect, he stomped on his head. Like, dog, the uh, fact that done. he basically used this man as a punching bag to be an example after he just tried to sneak him and he left mid-fight? <laughs> Bro, that's disgusting. He did, though. Damn, All right, the most disrespectful. Our next moment <laughs> is more JJK. This actually would have been a Jujutsu Kaisen special if the last one wasn't JJK. But anyways, Toto beating the absolute breaks off of Fushiguro. Now you see, this moment isn't just disrespectful, nah. This is also one of the most down bad horrendously moments to ever exist. So Toto and Mai pull up and they talking mad sh Mai said, heard your classmate died. Tell me, how hard did that pack hit? Oh, so nah, that's gonna cause a whole Fushi fight. Girl, oh, he says, hey, boy, what's your type? <laughs> Depending on the answer that you give me will determine if I beat the shit out of you or not. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? <laughs> this has to be one of the most wildest things I've ever heard come out of somebody's mouth. This is determined to run this man's fade if he does not like the exact same girls that he likes. So then he's like, come on now, speak up. How you like him, nigga? I like him tall. With a fat ass boy. Come on now, I ain't waiting on it. He's like, I right, uh as long as she has good character, she's a 10. Uh oh, here it goes. You go run it. So then Toto's like, damn, bro. He dropped a tear? You got bad taste. Huh? He cried. So he blesses this man. Good God, the clothesline from hell. 
then he walks up to him and says, I knew it. Just by first glance, you a bitch ass nigga. So Fushiguro pulls out these oh, frogs, but bro flash steps and takes them to Suplex City. Oh, hey. he so then he's pummeling him. He's like, fight back, nigga. You got bad taste and you sorry as hell. Yo, do something. Yeah. Face and slams him into the wall. How are you just like, eating up those punches like that? I ain't done yet. He starts lifting this man up through the entire building. Good. God, oh, man. Yo, this is just a boy. He's toe so up. Come on now, fight back, little boy. So as he's about to hit him again, Toge has to come and hit him with the chill out, chill out. Bruh. Then Panda oh, come in shit. and he like, yo, what are y'all doing? Then Toto says, his taste is trash. Let me beat his ass. <laughs> his taste is trash. He's like, ah, forget it. But next time I see your bitch ass, your taste better change, boy. He didn't even boy. fight back. The fact that this man Toto almost Dude, what you beat doing? this man girl to death because his taste in woman is bad. Like, uh, <laughs> he petty as hell. What? Bro, basically took your waifu is trash to the extreme. Uh, I, I'm just at a loss for words. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, our final moment. Probably, if not, one of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. Perfect Cell violating Vegeta. Lord have mercy, what can I say about this one? This needs no explanation. But you know what? First of all, these two buffoon ass oh, niggas. Let's yeah, start off go. with this cocky That's bastard. Oldie. That Saiyan Pride really had to kick in in full gear, huh? Bro, really let this man go absorb 18. And he was attacking Trunks, the only person with common sense during this entire moment. Yeah, dog, bro. You deserve to get your ass handed to you. Oh, and don't think I forgot about this bald bastard. Hey. You had one job, but you got one little smooch, one little Shit. puck on the He's cheek, and you was whipped Dang. into some cyborg coochie. Bro said, f the earth. Behavior. She bad as hell. Dang. Man, oh man, did these decisions come to bite y'all in the ass. So after Cell absorbed 18 and became perfect, Bro is just glorified by himself. Man, this is on narcissist level 100. Hey, yeah. Look at Vegeta, dumbass. <laughs> wow, he looks less intimidating. I thought we already learned this lesson with Frieza. When they look less intimidating, uh, they're yeah. strong as f Frieza crazy. So then Krillin goes like in that. and attacks this man. And Bro ain't even paying them any attention. Man's is like, wow. Damn, he just eating it up. Mm. Then Trucks came in and started attacking him. And he is still Yo. paying them no attention at all. He's then he ate the Destructo disc. Then he turns around and he's like, so you want to play little nigga? I right, oh, then snap. witness perfection. Look at him, he's uh, skipping what? to him. Then he gets up in his face and he's like, boo. He's teleporting bro breaks his neck and he is out cold. And look at him, he's like, ugh, weak ass nigga. 16, you wanna do something? Yeah, that's right. Stay your big ass right here. <laughs> so then <laughs> here it. comes Vegeta. But he's he's like, I see like you got people. that perfect jawline and everything now. So you ready to scrap? Then Cell says, ugh. I guess you'll be a decent warm up. So Vegeta just starts oh, throwing no, everything. Bro is just blocking it. Bro's like, my, <laughs> my prince, you're gonna have to do a little more than that to make me try now. So then Vegeta hits him with this kick and he's like, yeah, I did that. Nah, nice. <laughs> he ate it. Like, like really, dude? He ate that kid. Trash ass boy. So Vegeta's like, huh? What is this? And Cell's just laughing at him like, <laughs> and you came up with that corny ass name called Super Come Vegeta. On. Now let me show you how to throw a kick. So he kicks Ooh. the life out of this man. Look at him, he's flying the mountain. And then he just falls into the ocean. So Cell just starts talking. He's like, wow, you was talking all that good shit a second ago. Mm. Now look at your sorry ass. So then Vegeta does personally my favorite attack in anime. He starts oh. charging up the final flight. And Cell is just standing there. He's stunned. There Look at his face. Bro's looking at him like, man, you're you putting on a great light show, buddy. This rival's Disney World's fireworks show. For so real. then Vegeta just starts calling to him. Cell, you bitch ass, fuck ass. It ain't gonna do nothing. Done. If you think you hot, then stay your ass right there. So Cell's like, I oblige. So then Vegeta what? hits him with the final flash. And look at me like, oh my god. Oh. It ain't gonna be nothing. Damn, that was tough. No scratch. Still to this day, I wonder, what poor planet did that blast end up landing on? So everybody's like, oh my God, he's done it. Father's done it. So he blew off half of Cell's oh, chest. Shit. So Cell says, oh, oh, he actually hit me, did he? actually did some so damage. Like, yes, I did he it. He did it, bro. I am him. So while Vegeta keeps on <laughs> laughing, Cell says, stop laughing, damn it. He's talking that shit. Like, for real, stop laughing. <laughs> uh, 
Oh my god. Alright, guys, shit back. <laughs> Wait, he regenerated his arm. Oh my god, bro. It's just a look on his face nah, that gets me every time. Nah, he was regenerated. Did you forget that I had Piccolo cells as well, you dummy? So then Vegeta just losing it. He just starts spamming T Blast. But we all know. He when went Vegeta crazy resorts to using this spam T Blast move, it's over. So Cell just walks through it and just Oh, spam. that's tough. So he kicks him to high heaven and hits him with the spike. Damn. Bruh. The winner is I went to college. This man is unstoppable. Grass. <laughs> Dang. Damn. Well, at least Vegeta the most tried. Respectful moments in anime history five. Basically a JJK special with a little DBZ dab in there. I will have a poll on my Twitter and my IG later to see if y'all want homie right here on the table. I could either add him now or wait till the next arc gets animated, which I've already read by the way. So we'll decide that on the other platforms. But uh, hope y'all enjoy. Make sure to sub to the second channel. Follow you on IG and Twitter, Thanks. and uh, I am out of here. Shout out to CJ. Another good video. Facts. Gangsta. Let me know what y'all think. Love me color. He is out.